Sun is coming up, are you ready to go? We can take a ride, we can take it slow Your will is my law, I'ma let you be the boss Cause I'm going, you go I'll take you to a place, we can see it all Step off the edge, I can break your fall Your will is my law, I'ma let you be the boss Cause I'm Welcome back to my channel and thank you so much for clicking onto this video. Back with another vlog. Oh yeah, and this time we are in the Bahamas. If you've seen my Miami vlog, then you know that I'm a little bit hungover right now. But the hungover is pretty much gone. I, f I think I'm sobered up. I'm not entirely sure. Like, I'm still a little bit like... But yeah, I'm so happy to be here. I hope you guys enjoy this vlog. We got so much plans for this trip and I really hope you guys like it. Babe, are you excited to be here? Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, you're so cute. Before I shower and get ready and show you guys Bahamas, if you haven't seen my Miami vlog, make sure you guys do because it was pretty lit. It was pretty fun actually comes to think of it. Even though it was raining and the weather wasn't that great. Big shout out to Laura Mercier, by the way, for bringing us down to Miami. They launched some brand new primers. So yeah, make sure you guys check it out if you want to see some makeup with you and a mini makeup tutorial as well so yeah i'm gonna go shower stuff my face with lots of plantain is that how you say it plantain no, plantain plantain i'm going to stuff my face with lots of plantain this place is legit insane so i'm staying at the grand isle which is basically in the middle of exuma it's like a hotel but instead of staying in a hotel room you're staying in a villa so this whole entire part is just all villas so look at that that's a villa that's a villa there's villas everywhere and we have a nathan coming hello yep he's getting some b-roll shot <laughs> i went around like so many times at different angles yes i like the sound of that you're no, turning I... me on babe when you work hard you were really good like down and up one of the palm tree oh did work. you did you now insert footage was so delicious eating nice food whilst the sun's on you i don't know i like it i don't think many people would like it but i like it when you come from a cold country like england and it's damp most of the week i'm like yeah give me sun girl cheers mm. oh my god so delicious and refreshing thumbs up if you like lemonade look at that sunset it's so pretty oh my god and guys, the sunset gives you really nice filter. We need the sunset in England. I need this natural filter and I need to bring the sea as well. <laughs> so far, what do I think of the Bahamas? Amazing. <laughs> also guys, I got this really cool dome and this is how you take half sea, half land shots. Oh yeah, cannot wait to play around with some new tech. We are ready to sleep guys, but before I sleep, I'm gonna be actually editing a video. So I'm editing a video using all of like Laura Mercier products because I've always wanted to do that because I really love their base product. So make sure you guys check that out. That means so much to me. We based an excursion for tomorrow. So we're gonna do so many fun activities, but we're gonna be so exhausted when we come back. So we are going to go swimming with the pigs. We are going to swim with the sharks. We're gonna go see iguanas. And we are going cave diving as well, which I'm so excited about because literally everything I've always wanted to do is, is in the excursion tomorrow. So I'm really proud of myself for like coming here because originally I wasn't gonna go to Bahamas when I got invited to go to Miami. But then I thought, you know what? I've always wanted to go to Bahamas. Let me just do it. So yeah, I'm feeling really happy and just blessed to be here. Like, I don't know. I've noticed that with me, because I've been having a lot of personal issues and not been able to like handle stress i've noticed that whenever i go on a beachy holiday i just feel so much more better about myself so i said to nathan earlier i was like we should go on like a beachy holiday like three to four times a year and he was like no that's too much in it babe mm -hmm. and i was like no that's not that much <laughs> lights out see you tomorrow
Is that what your poo looks like? Iguana. Wow, look at all those iguanas up there. Oh, don't you two look so cute? Coco would be so jealous. Ah! Hello. Maybe this one's being protective. Okay, this one, there's something about this one that I don't like. Good morning, Bahama, Bahama Mama. <laughs> oh, yesterday was so incredible. Like, I did literally everything I wanted to do in the Bahamas, but all in one day. So, I just find it so cool that Bahamas had so many companies that do the excursions. Everything, like, everything. All you want to do, all you want to do is swim with the pigs, Iguana Island, Cave Davin, snorkeling. Like, anything you want to do in the Bahamas, you can literally do it in one day. Side note. If you are going to Bahamas, these are the, some of the things that you need to bring with you when you go to the excursion. So when I was going to swim in the pigs, Iguana Island, dive in, all of that, I recommend bringing not just one towel, but two towels because the excursion that I went on, the company, he didn't provide any towels, which is absolutely fine. Like, that's not his job, to be honest. So yeah, I recommend bringing some spare towels, bring lots of sunscreen. I mean, SPF 50, girl, because you're going to be out on the boat all day. I recommend bringing a big bottle of water, maybe some juice with you as well because it gets a little bit tiring spare clothes bring as many lightweight little itty bitty dresses like this like little summer dresses i can't remember where this is from i think this is from like pretty little thing just anything that you can throw on that you don't mind getting dirty and sandy like and a hat because girl you need to protect your skin another side note so swim with the pigs i just want to let you all know they are so feral it is so hard to take a cute picture with them how i managed to take my shots with them i don't know but i put nathan through a lot of stress yesterday to the point where he kind of like ignored me <laughs> throughout the whole day uh, bless him it was very difficult to take that instagram nurse shark shot as well like oh god oh my god God, yeah, it was really difficult and scary as well. It was really stressful because one, there's lots of people there, and also shooting with animals is is it's not like shooting with your friends, you know. It's not like you can tell them what to do. But the iguanas, though, the iguanas, I love the iguanas. I actually wouldn't mind if I had a pet iguana because they're just so chill and lazy. Like you just sit there, do nothing, and then when they walk, they're like this. It's so cute. I'm gonna try to take some pictures with stingrays, and that is the one animal. I'm afraid of. So I need to like stay calm and just face my fears. And I'm taking it with my dome as well, which I cannot wait because shooting with a dome, oh, amazing. Bahamas and I am in Chat and Chill, which is such a beautiful location. It's much bigger than I thought. I thought it's gonna be like a little tiny island. I mean, it is a small island, but there's so much activities to do here. Like, the stingray is literally right by the beach, so you can actually feed them, chill with them, take pictures of them, you know, all that jazz. You can rent a boat here as well, which is so insane. Me and Nathan wanted to rent a boat, but because we have no experience, we couldn't do it. But that is something I'm gonna look into when I go back to England, learn how to ride a boat, so that way when I go to these beautiful for islands, I can rent one. There's swings here. So many picturesque moments here as well, which is just, oh, bliss. This is like the place for Instagram photos. I'm not gonna lie, guys. <laughs> Coco Plum Beach is so beautiful! I feel like I own the place, which, you know, realistically I don't, but guys, you need to come down here. Perfect place to take pictures. Our friends are getting some sick drone shots. They also have like a sandbar out there as well, which is so cool. That's our friend. She's just chilling on the beach, getting some sick drone shots. Oh yeah, work it, work it, work it. Hey guys, so it is the last day in the Bahamas for us, and we're just gonna be doing nothing today, so I'm just gonna end the vlog right here, right now. But before I go, oh my god, 
squad, I need to show you guys the crazy bite marks that me and Nathan have. Like, look at all these bites. I have so many. And I've got a really itchy one on the back of my ankle as well. Nathan's is really bad. He's got so many. He's got loads more up here as well. So they're not mosquito bites. They're actually sand fly bites, which I've never heard of in my whole entire life. Basically, the receptionist lady was like, don't go to the beach early in the morning and don't go to the beach late in the evening because that's when the sand flies come out and bite you. But I'm just like, I was there during noon time, so I don't know. So if you are going to go to the Bahamas, guys, make sure you bring bug repellent because that is going to be your best friend. We also took Benadryl last night and that knocked us out, but it didn't like really get rid of the itch, which is so annoying. But this, this is our second bottle. But anyway, I really hope you enjoyed this vlog. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. Make sure you subscribe to my channel as well in case you haven't. And I will see you in my next video. I upload every Wednesday and Sunday. It would mean so much to me if you guys checked out my other videos. And hopefully, I'll see you in the next one. Bye!